Hello everybody, this is Tamer Radwan from Tommy Lens Photography. Today we are going to show you the latest version of Adobe Photoshop CC 2017. We are going to talk about the four things which is the most improvement in Adobe. Let's start by new document. You have seen before in 2015 and CS6 normal opening Today we have good menu, which is photo, you can get a ready template, default Photoshop size, landscape, landscape, different sizes. And also you can see some illustrator, ready template also, even for web, mobile, film and video. The second thing we're going to talk about the panorama. We usually used to do panorama in Adobe Lightroom, but this time we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pictures for the mountain. And after that, if we need to combine all, we just need to go for the search. You can see here at this time, search, and you just type panorama, P-A-N-O, and then you find this one here you just need to browse your photos or you just can use the same photos which is you open it already and you make mark with control like this like that after that you choose auto or different menus but the result really is amazing here we go third thing we're going to talk about the most beautiful filter it's going for portrait if we see this guy I shot him already last year and that's here we can go for liquid when you open the liquid you can see here the new option it's auto deduction for the face you see the eyes right left nose lips even the shape of the portrait here the new options regarding eyes which is you can control how the eyes is big small to put it uh, bigger or smaller this is up to you look here at the left side of this eyes we're gonna control here to make it smaller or to increase more the same at the right side you can do the same if you go for the nose even also you can do it down or you can put it up it's up to you even also for the mouth you can do smile and for the upper lips and lower lips also you can control it which is here make it smaller bigger you can see here we can control everything after we took your shot so this is really amazing an improvement in Adobe Photoshop 2017 if you're gonna save this photo you can see here the difference between this one comma Z you can see the difference okay last thing with us we're gonna talk about combining photos here we go we have this one I shot in Africa last year and there is also one guy he was doing some fishing there and this picture is mostly the same background but we need to combine both together how we do let's see first of all we need to hold this by the right and we go sorry we have to make the select okay again hold this and then go up for the second picture don't leave the mouse just drop it down here now you can leave the mouse okay here we go this guy it's mostly like portrait 
and we can reduce the size by command T little bit just to reach the edge of the that uh, wave breaker okay enter done after that we go for select and select unmask usually this is both pictures we have to select this one here and then to start here to mark slowly it's going on then after that we can make that transparent you see There is some here, you can just remove it. And now it's the correct one. You press OK and then you can see the difference between the photos. This is the normal one and this is the second one. If we do here, you can see the difference. Thank you for watching us. Please follow us 